Welcome, you're watching Kaleidoscope selling Kalife News Capsule. Coca-Cola Sri Lanka recently broke new ground by becoming the first country in India and Southwest Asia to launch the large returnable glass bottle, also called the Big Buddy Pack. And in its 61-year history in Sri Lanka, Coca-Cola has been working steadily to reduce its carbon footprint, recognizing that its industry is energy and water intensive. Managing Director of Coca-Cola Sri Lanka, Pankaj Singha, joined me in the studio for a brief chat. Coke launching the large returnable glass bottle is certainly groundbreaking in Sri Lanka. But in your um, presence here in Sri Lanka, there's much more that has been happening from the sustainability angle and reducing your carbon footprint. Can you tell me a little bit about what Coke has been doing in that space? Coca-Cola has been in Sri Lanka for 61 years and in these 61 years we have taken some very strong measures uh, towards a sustainable future, sustainable Sri Lanka. So the first one which would, I would like to talk about that is that we have the largest solar rooftop project uh, anywhere in Sri Lanka at our Biagama facility. Uh, it, it produces almost 1.95 megawatts of power. Uh, the second one will be our commitment towards water neutrality and supporting sustainable agriculture. Uh, we, uh, for every liter of beverage which we make uh, or every liter of water which we use, we return back more than 203% uh, to the mother nature and uh, that's all in Sri Lanka. A and the last one will be to working towards sustainable packaging. So the Big Buddy launch which you see uh, is one such initiative where we have, uh, our endeavor is to increase re refillable uh, PET, uh, refillable packs and the last one is our commitment towards the world without waste. Uh, we remain committed to uh, uh, pick up and recycle every single bottle which we produce in Sri Lanka by the year 2030. On your goals, we will take care of the risks. Silly good life.